Hello again, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to part three of Amnesia, A Coward's Death. Where we left off last time, we were about to go through this door. So let's do it. Oh. Duh. Okay. Uh, it's still so freaking dark. Oh, that must be my dog. Okay. I don't know why I break every single pot I come across. I know some custom stories like to put goodies in them. And I haven't seen any, which I am a little concerned about. Ooh! See me your sawn back box lady. In a certain ancient civilization, when a man died, his heart was weighed against a feather to judge his purity during life. How heavy is your heart, Sean? How heavy with sin? Who are you? What's going on here? Where is Evangeline? I cannot tell you the answers. Only show you how to find them. Do you remember what happened in this room? I don't... Remember? Why can't I remember? Be patient, Jean. First, you should light a candle. It's rather dark in here, don't you think? It's dark in this whole freaking game. Shut up, lady. Like they're borrowing from the sequel that must not be named again. Hey, jump. Thank you. This guy must be an Olympic jumper or something. I don't think even Daniel did that well. Ugh. It's a polar. Locked. Wait. Why would he? Yeah. It's so easy to get turned around in this area. Ooh. It wasn't here. Oh, cool. The bathroom. For when I have to uh, avoid soiling myself. Did I already do that joke? I can't remember. <laughs> I do not like this. Nope. Yep. Where's the closet? Go into the closet. dogs in here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Good girl, Nikki. Good girl. Okay. I forgot to mention that I have my uh, trusty plushy sidekick with me. Balto will protect me, right, Balto? Just a fleshy. Okay. 
and it's all light again. Uh, why is it so dark? Excuse me. I watched that one poser emo episode of South Park last night where they thought plants were making people emo. <laughs> yeah. Ex an extra reason to be paranoid of plants now. 20 years. 20 years have gone. Yet my past pursues me like a starving vulture. Each letter from Guillaume filled with such rage and venom was a thorn in my mind. I cannot sleep without seeing his face. I locked the compound in my safe and threw the key into the fire. I know no other way to bear it but to put it out of my sight. I am afraid to speak to Guillaume. I have no words that would abate his anger. I am afraid of Evangeline seeing these letters. I don't want her to see my shame. I wish to be a decent man. Though I am a smoking mute. Sad face. Empty bottle. And he says something about a key in the fire. I can't touch that. It's fire. It'll burn me. my door. No, that's the... Hmm. That's back towards that way. That's the back run. One of the creators, I think it's Damascus himself, has quoted that the best way to induce fear is for darkness to blind people so that they have to imagine everything themselves and to induce claustrophobia. But if your players can't see, which I was watching Markiplier play this last night up to where I had gotten and even he was saying stuff about it, but I don't know if anyone else has. Is this... Oh no, wait, I've already been here because there was that... Uh, I have a bo empty bottle and I have a fire to put out. Where can I find some water? Well, where's... Yeah, uh... <laughs> nope. I'm still so used to Minecraft controls. Dub. Sink. What? Oh. Oh. Toilet. <laughs> Mm. 
No, that's not the fire. So, um, I don't know how many custom stories are out there, I'm sure there's a lot. I at one point wanted to make one, but I can sit at, well, huh, I wanted to make my own models and stuff because I have a few story projects I'm working on, but I figured it would look a lot better on a portfolio and stuff, and I think it would be a lot more fun to actually just make a game. And. I've been giving it a lot of thought and stuff, though I would still have a lot of work to do to actually learn how to make environments and everything. Ooh, that was okay. Gee, safety, and that's down here. There we go. But, um, I was a art and technology major of an Ohio State. I graduated almost a year ago. I haven't really been able to find anything yet. Mostly because I was trying to do five classes at, and working some absurd amount of hours a week. So I didn't have much time to really do as well as my projects as I probably should have or build a portfolio. I would probably leave at 9 or 10 in the morning and not get back till after 11 at night e every day of the week except for the weekends and then I spent the weekends catching up on sleep. It was bad. But I've been working on my modeling and everything now and I have Unity so I was hoping to start some stuff soon. Or I also have RPG Maker and a friend of mine has RPG Maker and he's a writer so Oh my gosh! What was that? What what? What was that? That looks like no Facebook, no was near, no it was nowhere near as fun or fighting. I have to go that way. I don't know how long I've been recording for it either. Let's go see it. Balto will protect me. I also don't know if I mentioned this in the previous part or not, but when I was trying out for the voices, I was saying Guillaume completely off. I was saying Guillaume or something. It was not smart of me. Oh no, that, yeah, okay. Wait. Oh, okay, let's go play more pool. Does it go in your pocket, stupid? And someone took this back down again. Oof. Hey, it's daylight. And there's a statue in the window. to 
the house this morning. His name is Guillaume. Do you know him, Sean? Balto, you didn't protect me. It's okay, Nikki. Was it all a dream? Was it not real? Dreams are real, Jean. Even the ones inside your head. In this mansion, though, they are a little more substantial. <laughs> What was it? What was that monster? How cruel to call him a monster. He used to be your partner, until you betrayed him for the money. If there is a monster in these halls, it is only one that you created. Okay, guys. I think after that, and also scaring my dog a little, well, take a little break. I'll see you in part four, and until then, bye bye